All right, guys. So before we get started with today's show, I want to inform you that there are many ways that you can support this show. I have some clickable links right down here. If you would like, I have a subscribe star, which is a subscription service, and you get some amazing perks if you sign up. And I also have a store where I have prints available and I have some other goodies and social media and things of that nature. So if you want to support me, please check out where you can help me out, you know? And with that said, <laughs> let's get going. Ready? Start the show! So those for you who don't know what a cryptid is, it's a noun and it's uh, an animal that has been claimed to exist, but never proven to exist. <laughs> Today, class, we're going to cover one that is widely known, and that is the Loch Ness Monster. So, this is described as a long necked creature with one or more humps that stick out of the water. Like so. Uh, the origin of this one is from Scotland. And there have been many different sightings of this creature and different hoaxes and wild stories. Um, and they range, and I will read you from my book. There, there's, there's quite a lot going on with this one here. Uh, <laughs> some people thought they saw an elephant mixed with an octopus, sea serpents, a giant salamander, and even a water horse-like creature. So there's there's a big wide range of different things that people over in Scotland thought that they've seen crawling up out of the water over there. And uh, you might be familiar with a famous photograph of Nessie, the black and white one that looked kind of like that. That was taken by a guy named Arthur Grant and that was in 1934. And he claimed he saw a plesiosaur cross the road and then not long after he had his sighting, then we saw this photograph emerge. And this photograph was published in the Daily Mail and for 60 years, that one photograph was actually used and considered as evidence that this, this monster, or if it wasn't a monster, maybe it's friendly and it's not really a monster. Maybe it's like a big puppy. I don't know. But it was this photograph was used as evidence that this creature actually existed. And later, it was determined that that photo was a fake. So, that's what I got on cute little Nessie here. So, I hope you guys learned something. 